All right, a very quick video here. Um, I have a few things to show you DVD-wise. Uh, one Blu-ray, five DVDs. Gonna start with unpackaging two things here. Uh, uh, these arrived yesterday, and actually, I was thinking that, judging on the price on the on the front, I really couldn't figure out what this might be. So I actually had a peek inside, and uh, so it's a little bit cheating because I know what it is. Uh, sometimes I feel like when people do that, they put the stuff back in the package and take it out and call it an unboxing. I'm like, well, what's the point with that? And now I'm kind of doing the same thing, but I haven't taken it out yet. I've just peeked inside to make sure what it is. <laughs> anyway, it's ER Season 8. Um, I also ordered Season 7, so I'm not going to be able to watch this yet. Uh, so, uh, But I'll talk more about the show whenever I unbox the seventh one. It's gonna be, I mean, there's gonna be other um, um, unboxing, I mean, it's gonna be an unboxing video with this and some other stuff, so that's gonna come up and I'll talk more about the show, more about this then, I think. Um, let's see, this one, kind of like a stupid purchase actually, because the white ribbon, artificial eye release, and this is a great film, but the thing is, I al already have it, but this is a rental. And I wanted, I, I watched it recently, and I wanted to get this release instead because I don't like the rentals. So, yeah, I mean, I'm, I guess I'll keep it sealed for now until I watch it the next time. I could mention the document, I mean, the uh, special features, they're really great. There's a making of documentary where you get to see how Michael Haneke, the director, sorry, I didn't mention that, uh, where, how he works. Uh, portrait of Michael Haneke, uh, about him. Uh, can, is, um, can film festival feature at interview. There's about two hours of, of, of special features and the same ones uh, you can find on this release. So really There's I mean, I just like this release more so I picked it up for that which is kind of pointless, but <laughs> You know um, Then let's see I have four titles that I bought today. I had to do some errands in town and on my way there I had a limited amount of time to do a bunch of things. I didn't have time to do all of them. Uh, partly because I went to a movie store first and I wasted, wasted some time there. Which I didn't intend to do when I left. But when I was on my way to where I was actually going, I was like, ah, let's just go to the movie store. And I found four things. Um, let's see here. I found, first of all, uh, the miniseries Neverwhere. I recently read the uh, book Neverwhere by Neil Gaiman. And uh, I was happy to find this at the movie store. Um, I haven't heard great things, but this does have an audio commentary but with Neil Gaiman, so it should be fun to listen to that. I think maybe I'll watch, I'll watch it first and then listen to at least some of it. We'll see how how much I'm, I'll enjoy it. But I think I'll probably listen to that as well. There's an interview with him too. Uh, yeah, the, the book was good, so it should be fun to watch this and especially hear Neil Gaiman's commentary to this, so that's, that should be great. Um, then I picked up the, 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 <laughs> the other three titles, they're Swedish titles. The first one might be a little bit more interesting than the other two, though. This is a Frostbite, a Swedish kind of horror comedy. This, I believe, is kind of all of these three titles that I found, except for that one. They're not too easy to find. Well, this one is not that easy to find in Sweden, I guess. So, four good finds, definitely. But uh, this one and the other two, I think they might be out of print, or at least two of them. One of them, I don't know what it is. Anyway, this one I searched for online now that I got home. It's on Amazon. I would have had to pay more for that if I bought it from Amazon. But from Swedish websites, it's not even avail available. So, that's pretty good. It's, uh, I guess, like... Um, <laughs> I don't know too much about it, um, but it stars, um, which I've known about for years, it stars a girl who was in a Swedish, uh, let's see, I actually have it over here. <clears throat> she was in this, she's right there. She. This was a childhood favorite of mine, kids movie, there is another one actually. But uh, she stars in this uh, in 2006, so like how many years later? 14 years later, uh, I guess that's her right there. So I've always been interested to see this just because of that, to see that little girl in, in this movie. I mean, it just seems so odd to me because that was a childhood favorite of mine. 
um, but yeah it should be should be fun let's see um, the other two are Swedish like I said this one I actually actually looked for a couple days ago online because I, I wanted to get it but I it's not available it's it's out of print or it's um, just not available and it's a Swedish kind of hidden camera show situation Magnusson uh, Magnusson Peter Magnusson that's the guy who's doing the behind the scenes stuff and um, I used to see to watch this um, it's from 2006 I might have seen it more recently than that but it's been a long time at, at any rate so it should be fun to watch again and I was happy to find it there because uh, I had just been looking for it it did cost me like 11 bucks but I think it's worth it and it's a used DVD but I like I said I really want to see this again so it should be fun uh, the last title is a documentary that I randomly found uh, a place like this which it's a, probably a very obscure Swedish documentary that I, I had never heard of it it's only 43 minutes so I paid a little bit more than one crown for each minute well actually there's um, 23 minutes of special features too but it's about this um, I like I like these ty uh, type of documentaries it's um, uh, sort of a small little town village uh, community where these three people I'm not sure if they're gonna be eccentrics or not but uh, it's about the three of them and their lives and um, their ambitions and their you know current situations and their thoughts and whatever and uh, it's you know I guess that's what it is um, maybe to most people this DVD will not stick out from the shelves <laughs> like it did to me but I really, like I said, I really enjoy these documentaries about just people. Um, so yeah, but I've never heard of, heard of it before. So it should be should be a good watch, I think. So that really is uh, everything for this time. Only, uh, yeah, n a few things, not too much this time. Um, hopefully, well, yeah, there's gonna be a, an unboxing next week, I think, at least pretty soon. Hopefully, that's that's gonna be a there's gonna be a lot more than that. Uh, I am expecting a few titles. So yeah, that's it. Um, also got a pretty big uh, what I've watched video coming up. So yeah, so yeah, that's it. Thank you very much for watching.